Hey y'all! Okay, so in this last video, this is going to be part three because I did not finish my lashish. And I need to have another sip of coffee with y'all. Okay. How's everybody doing? I know it's part three, you're like that. You're in part three of a simple, what are my favorites? Get ready with me, stop video and there's a hair on your nose yes 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 y'all you know, do y'all have any eyelashes by the way that just grow cockeyed mine do i have some that just like grow that way that way and that way they don't grow up and little pr pretty curls you know who has the prettiest lashes ever hillary my friend hillary has lashes that make you want to vomit they're super long. They look like a pair of falsies. They're so perfect, but they're so soft. They're like mink lashes. And then they curl right on the end. I don't mean curl back and look weird. I mean perfect curl up. Some people are just born with it, y'all. But for the rest of us, there are eyelash curlers and lots of good makeup. Now, this is not a good eyelash curler. This is not my Chanel or my... Um, CoverGirl. I don't know what brand this is, but it's not very good. But I cannot find my Chanel. I think I feel it, it fell out of my purse yesterday when I, I bent over with my purse on my shoulder like an idiot to get a um, knockout rose. Is that what you're calling them? Yeah, knockout roses. Because I want to plant some. Because they'll be pretty and they will look gorgeous and they will smell like roses. Which I'm not crazy about the smell of roses, but I am when it's in a garden. Does that make sense? I don't like the smell of roses in cosmetics. Like, you know, the lip stuff, I don't like the rose one. I like the peach one and I love the Chanel one. It doesn't have a smell and I love the way it smells. I don't really like putting my finger in a pot because I have long nails and they can stick down in it. So, Chanel also makes the exact same balm in a um, screw-up regular lipstick tube. I think it's the exact same thing, to be honest with you. It may be two different things. But anyway, I love the, that better than swirling my finger around. But I love the one that you swirl your finger around. It just is so good. I never did brush my eyebrows up. I don't always. I don't always do that. Ah, my hairs are everywhere. I need a haircut so bad, y'all. Just trying to decide what I'm going to do. Am I going to go brown? That's my natural hair color. It's not blonde. Um, oh, I'm going to use this again. This is the Maybelline, the Colossal Big Shot. Y'all, I'm really liking this. Yes, I know you're saying bad. Didn't you just say that your all-time favorite was Chanel Inimitable, and then it changed, and you couldn't believe it, that it was Maybelline Colossal Volume Express or whatever that was, and now you're switching to Maybelline Colossal Big Shot. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm saying. So I always tip the lashes out first so they're nice and coated. I will do at least two and probably three coats. See, this eyelash curler did not curl at all. I think the rubber on it must be giving way or the spring because that didn't do, it, it's almost like it didn't do anything. And that definitely affects the way your lashes are going to look. If they don't bend upward, it's very hard to get any voluminous look out of them. So what you can do is, watch this, I'm going to put it on and I'm just going to very slowly curl upward, almost like I'm bending it. And since this is waterproof, it should be kind of sticking in that position. That'll help. That's round one. That's a process. It's up for Hillary, who doesn't even wear mascara most of the time. It just makes me sick. Hillary, if you're listening, which I think you do. I think you do follow my videos. Thank you so much, sweetie. That means a lot to me. Um, but your eyelashes made me want to vomit. <laughs> okay, let's just admit it. I lust after them. I want your lashes. It's wrong. The Lord says we shouldn't be envious of other people, but I am. So, the Lord, forgive me. I'm not envious to the point that I would ever take it away from you, though. I want you to have them. They look good on you. But I just wish I had long, beautiful lashes, too. But since I don't, I'll just use mascara. That really is something I always wanted. I tried the extensions, and I felt so pretty, even though I was still overweight. And, of course, none of us feel pretty when we're overweight. And uh, a friend of mine says, Look, honey, I just accept who I am. I've tried to diet for years. 
and that's just that's the shape of me at this point in my life and I think that is a very healthy way uh, to think I don't necessarily think it's a healthy way to live because it's not good for your heart or the possibility of getting diabetes so no it's not healthy honey but she, I think she, what she was saying is it's, it's, it's more important to her to have a healthy self-image than put herself down all the time. And I do agree with that. I tend to put myself down sometimes. We shouldn't do that, ladies. We should lift each other up. That's what we're here for, help each other. Or as one of my songs I wrote says, help each other out. What was it called? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> and YouTube, if you're listening, I wrote that song, so I don't have to copyright it. I never made it to, um, I mean, we produced it, and it's on a 8-track. Uh, I'm just kidding. It's on a cassette. That's how old that song is. So this is a very buildable mascara. All mascaras really are, but they, they especially the uh, waterproof ones, really make a difference when you start building them on the second and third round. See, there's this really screwy... No matter how much I curl them in the right direction, they just want to go caddy-walked. They're just really weird. I never have figured out why really, like, highly paid makeup artist like Mario, I think, does Kim, uh, Chris Kardashian. I know he does Kim, but I'm talking about when, um, ah, did you see what I just did? When um, Chris Kardashian, I didn't watch it, but I've, I've seen short clips of it from other things. I think it's where she was upset with um, Bruce Jenner for turning into a woman, and uh, she cried, and there's this black mascara going all down her cheeks, and I'm like, did your makeup artist not know this might be an emotional time and you should wear waterproof? Hello. You need me to do your makeup. <laughs> I bet what he gets paid, I could quit working. That'd be something, wouldn't it? To be, to be that highly paid to do famous people's makeup. And there's some of the makeup, uh, um, artists out there on YouTube do professionals. I know Candy Johnson does. She's done a lot of professionals. Uh, pro Hollywood actors and actresses. Because she's shown them. Charlotte Tilbury does a lot of runway models. I've seen her do Cara Delevingne. And she did her with, um, also added some Chanel. I think it was her. Or, let's see. I don't guess Charlotte would be promoting Anything with Charlotte Tilbury. Who was it who did it? Lisa, um, Lisa, I can't think of her name. It's not Etheridge Rutledge. Lisa, I'm sorry. She's a famous makeup artist. <laughs> she does a lot of videos on YouTube. I'll put her name below. So I'm going in for a third round, mainly because of these wild hairs. And my hair keeps getting. I need to pull my hair back. Why does this hair want to be in my face? Alright. So see, as you build, what happens, and the reason it looks so voluminous, is it's just mascara caked up on mascara. And that's why you have to keep, do you notice how I keep combing it through and using the very tip end to kind of straighten each one because it will start looking pretty thick if you don't. See how that's looking thick? This is last round. But I'm going to be outside and it's hot and I don't want this to sweat off. See how I was thinking in advance, Mario? I know you watch my makeup videos. Would you like me to give you some helpful tips, sir? With all due respect. Who is that? Makeup by Mario? Is that who that is? I think it is. On Instagram, I think that's what it is. Again, I'm tipping out the ends to straighten these lower lashes a little bit. Okay, so that's it for today. Do you like? Do you like it? 
that's my look. I am also going to be doing a Birch Box versus Ipsy today. I'm going to do a haul video of some clothes that I got for around the house. Like, not dress up clothes to go out. There's a couple of shirts to wear to work, but it's mainly some casual, like this. This one of them. I don't know if you can see this. It's just a casual gray like silky jersey cotton blend and it's so comfortable i'm wearing my necklace from my husband that he got me that says i am blessed and highly favored and how wonderful he's so good to me y'all i am very very blessed in that arena and lots of arenas i got lots of reasons to be feel blessed anyway i'm also going to show you some shoes and a tanning product that i got so thanks for staying through these three videos i love you guys and i'll see you again soon bye